What's up, everybody? We're back, Green Valley Ranch once again. We just took a $40 loss uh, chasing the 1723. Um, we decided not to go in anymore, but I'm gonna reset here. I'm gonna go after my 17 and try to make up for it. So let's go low. Um, we're gonna try to do a hedge. I'm gonna try to work this. I got $20 budget. That's all I'm gonna do, no more than that. So let's see if we can recover my money right there. Um, my girlfriend and I went half and half on that previous session. So if I can get a, a bailout here, she'll get half her money. I'll get my half back. Let's see if we can get it, guys. Let's go. 17, one through 18. We were patient before. All right, we'll take a one. So that is a hedge right there, and that's what we like giving us more opportunities. And if you guys missed it, um, the reason why we went after them or played our numbers to begin with, because when we showed up, they were on the hot list. They were three times each. Usually, yeah, mine's on the zero, the 17, but that's what I'm playing. So hopefully it wants to show up. Um, but kind of interesting because usually we see the hot list, um, we see two or three X's transpire into um, five, six X, sometimes even seven or eight. But we figured, hey, let's, let's try to catch one. And unfortunately it wasn't our morning to catch one. So we, uh, we, we had a decent amount of spins too, an adequate amount of shots given our bankroll and the uh, fact that we were playing two numbers, yeah, but... we definitely saw... What was it, 25 minute yeah, session? Yeah, we probably saw about 40 spins. All right, so let's get that 17 right here, guys. Let's get that revenge. We're looking for it. One time. Oh, just don't be the... Uh... All right, that's a high, so... And I think I'm gonna go follow the winner. So I'm gonna martingale that. I'm gonna go two on that, see if we can get back that previous loss there. Half of it anyway, I should say because we are losing two dollars total but uh as i said before um it's a little uh you, you can get really wiped out hard or you can chase pretty deep um, with single numbers they have a tendency to sleep they but do. but when you're playing two like that you hope it doesn't and uh, with the amount of hedging and you know profits we were making we figured we'd be able to weather any kind of storm but unfortunately it just didn't go our way so yeah it was bad but hey if we can get a hit here we'll be looking good that's right have a nice recovery. Let's see that 17 show up for us, guys. I got a good feeling we're going to see it soon. We're going to be here to see it transpire. Whoa, that was a weird bounce. 36. All right, playing the high for a profit. So that worked out. Follow the winner. So we're going to recoup half of our previous loss. That's going to put us at 19, which is better than being uh, where we could have been. So we're happy with that result. And we are firing away. I usually start at 50 cents, but I'm going for dollars because, like I said, this is kind of a recovery attempt. So... If we can't recover, it's going to be $60 down, but glass is always half full. We're going to get that recovery, guys. Um, it looks like we haven't had a middle dozen in a long time, so you know what we're going to do? We're going to play that middle dozen, so we're going to go 50 cents on it. Um, we'll have a 50 cent profit. It will also juice up our 17 when it hits here, but if you take a look, the reason why I quantified or thought about doing it is because, I mean, how many spins has that been? Holy heck. I should be juicing it up. All right, let's go. Let's go. Come on, 17. Come on, 17. 17, let's go. Get a bounce. 29. And that's not in our dozen, but that's all right, because look at that. How long has that been? So let's go back here, guys, to the middle. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So it's been 15 spins since that middle dozen has hit. That is unreal. So it gives me a little more confidence to juice it up. Let's go $1.50 on it. Um, we're going to try to make something happen that way. Hopefully we can get the profit here. If we do get the middle dozen, it'll put us back to 1950, which will be pretty much our starting point. It juices up that 17, so hey, that would be a pretty much a recovery right there. So send us your love, your vibes. We appreciate all the support. And 23, now we're on the both on the cold list at zero. Let's get that 17 right here. 17. We need a big bounce. 21, and that's in the middle dozen, guys. So whoo, juiced it up just in time. Puts us back to 1950. So love being there, much better than. Uh, taking the L's along the ride. So 1950 is where we stand. And now I don't have as much confidence playing the middle dozen, but I do have to say that when it shows up after sleeping for that long, it tends to hit. So let's go, let's go. Um, we're actually gonna make a profit on, or no, we're gonna break even on that. Excuse me, if we get a hit there. So let's continue working this middle dozen here. Kind of unreal that our 1723 hit 3X before we showed up. I guess our timing was wrong today, huh? And that's what it is, guys. Luck, gambling, timing, all of the above. Well, it's so. funny because zeros hit twice. 33. Come hit on, twice. 17, right here, right here, machine. Show us that 17. Uh, 19. 19. That's the middle dozen. Middle so dozen. there we go. It's funny how we talked about that too. We see that a lot when it disappears. And was that just a break even? That's a break even. So that's a hedge, but that's okay because all we need to do is weather this storm. That's a, the extended storm that we're in here. 1950. 
Um, do I lose faith in my middle dozen now? Do I stick with it? Looks like we haven't had a low side in a while, so... Although, um, I could go with that. The only problem is if I start juicing it, it doesn't help. But let's go with the middle, uh, let's go with the first. Let's see if it wants to revert over there, so... First dozen's gonna be our hedge. And um, what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to give stretch out my bankroll as far as possible. Um, I don't want to get too crazy with my hedging, so I'm using less of the table um, to try to make up for the misses rather than using a higher coverage system. But we're going to see that 17 smack, guys. Let's manifest it together. Come on. 17. Get in the 17. Oh, so Seven. close. Hey, look at that. Made the right move there. Yeah, that was good. So that was good. And since we had a repeating middle dozen and then we had repeating highs, let's stick with the repeater. So let's just repeat the bet. Let's see if we can get that 17 to hit. You know what? We did have quite a bit of run out of that high dozen over there. Eh, maybe I won't get too uh, caught up in that. We'll just, we'll stick with our single dozen hedge on that single uh, left dozen over there. One through 12. We're going to smack it. Come on. Let's go. Slow spin. We, like we do have the slow spin. We often talk about slow spins transpire into uh, positive let's results for us. So. Spin on that 17. Let's make it happen. Come, Come on, 17. 17. Oh, we needed a big bounce, and we don't. Ooh, six. Six. Uh, we are playing that. Look at that. So we see the repeaters, guys. Look, isn't that kind of weird? Yeah. Too bad I didn't uh, have a little more juice. Yeah. That's all right, though. Like I said, we're trying to weather the storm give ourselves more opportunities and less because I mean imagine if we had still been going at our uh, numbers with the bets we were at you know it could get quite uh, costly here so now we're gonna revert all the way over to the third since we had a back-to-back -back middle a back-to-back -back first the third's been neglected for a while so we're gonna go with the third dozen as our hedge single unit 50 cents one dollar on that 17 if you guys could pull out your one times uh, anytime I'd appreciate if we did it right now machine if you allow me to use my one time I'm using it right now show me that 17 here come on Let's go. And if you notice the little wire near your 17. Oh, yeah. Come on, 17. 17. Come on, 17. Let's go. Oh, big bounce. We need a Get on big. There. Oh, that's a three. So, wow, that first dozen hitting uh, three times in a row there. All right, so, what do we do here? Middle dozen hasn't hit in quite a while, so it's been one, two, three. You know, let's go back to it. The only reason I'm saying that is because if I if I add to that, it contributes to that. So there's a net gain on both aspects. If we can hit that 17 right now, um, I could stick with the single dozen over there, but the higher I increase my bets, um, the, it robs the equity away from the 17. So I really don't want to do that. I don't want to have that effect on the outcome here. So let's get that positive result we're looking for. $39 returned on that 17 hit right here. Let's get it. Glass is always half full. We're gonna manifest it right now, 17. Come on, 17. Come on, 17. Oh, get a big bounce. That's a 30, so. Unfortunately, I moved it off that third dozen. That would have been nice if I stuck with it, but like I said, I don't want the effect of uh, taking away or robbing equity from my hit over there, so we're gonna stick with that. If we get a hit right here, um, that will put us back up to 18, which we're okay with. We don't need to make it all back in one hit, and we do wanna be able to ride out that negative variance that we could encounter. Let's get it, guys. Here we go. Positive vibes. We're going to wait for that 17 to hit. Let's see if we can do it. Let's go. Come on, 17. Where are you? So if we did a, our previous session was 25 minutes, we're now nine minutes into this session, 35 minutes without seeing a uh, repeater on one of our numbers after they hit 3x. So it shows you that repeaters don't indicate that they're uh, necessarily going to hit either. Whoa, 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 wow. Whoa, 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 wow. Out, and then the Did you see that bounce? Hot. Did you see the way that that bounced though? Yeah, that was very, weird. weird. Alright, not the result that we like to have happen, but I guess we have to have it happen because it did, so. Alright, we're juicing that up here. So once again, the nice effect of juicing that up is that our 17 gets a nice juice as well. So, um, how far removed are we from that middle? One, two, three, four, five spins from that middle, so. Let's see if we can get the love we're looking for right here, guys. Middle dozen, 17. Oh, we got a slow spin. If you guys didn't use your one time, let's use them up now. The slow spins usually are uh, indicative of those good results. Let's see the 17. 17 from my cold list. Uh, it's going to go hot right here. Let's go. 17. Nope, not enough unless it gets a big bounce. Oh, oh it hit. Unreal, guys. Look at We recovered. Unreal. And the middle, too. So, so glad we did that. We didn't rob any equity. And we are back, guys. So... We are in for a total of 40 on the first session, 
20. Yeah, we're in for 60, guys. 53.50. Although that's a loss, I'm going to consider that a win. So, you know what? Let's go for the back to back, though. 17.23. Let's see if one of them wants to do it. Um, what else should we play? Anything else? Zeros. All right. There we go, guys. We're going to take one more shot at it. We're back, everybody. So. Thank you guys for sending us your love, the positive vibes, helping us make it happen. As I always say, the glass is half full. You're never down and out. So. Never down and out. Let's get a back-to-back. 1723. We see back-to-backs all the time. 17, Can we get one? 1723 or the zero. Yeah, we got, a, we got a plethora of options, guys. Let's go. Let's nail one. Let's go. 1723 zeros. 1723 zeros. Oh, 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 I thought I was going to get a zero. All right, so we're going to take that little L right there. But overall, that's a dub for us. I mean... On this session, on this yeah, yeah, we're gonna take an eight dollar loss, but hey, I'm happy about that. So, all right, guys. So there we go. Second session of the day. That's gambling for you. That's roulette. Luckily, we got fifty cent limits that we can work with. Otherwise, otherwise, uh, roulette can be expensive, as you guys saw when you start chasing two numbers, using hedges, and trying to get profit. It gets uh, quite costly. So hopefully, you guys enjoyed these past two sessions. We're gonna uh, probably come back and do it again, take a little break. So make sure you guys like and subscribe. We appreciate all the support. Coming at you from Green Valley Ranch, second session of the day, in for 20, out for 52. Like and subscribe. We appreciate all the support. Until next time. Until next time. Until after the spin. Oh, almost in the zeros. All right, until next time.